This video is sponsored by BCA Bearings, the number one supplier of OE quality hub assemblies. Visit bcabearings.com for more information. Okay, I got a question for you. When should you use a hammer and not use a hammer? And what kind of hammer should you use when you're dealing with a hub unit? Keep this in mind, you could use a hammer on a hub unit that's attached to a vehicle as long as the bearing is preloaded. In other words, it has the nut installed and everything is tight. Because chances are what you could do with this hammer doesn't compare to what the bearing has to endure on the roads. Just think about it, a 4,000 pound vehicle going up and down over a pothole, you could not recreate this with this hammer or even this hammer. So just keep that in mind. If you're removing a stuck rotor or splines from the inside, yes, take care that you do not damage the seal with a hammer. But whale away, but just be careful on what you're hitting. Also, if you suspect that you may have done any damage, pull out a dial indicator and measure for run out. But bearings are very, very tough. And what they have to endure on the roads, it's amazing. Just think about that. All the weight of a vehicle on something the size of a business card. So it can endure this. So don't think that you can damage it with one of these. I'm Andrew Markell. Thank you very much.